Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Kanyad, or Chaos Construct, if you prefer it. And today, I decided to return to Minecraft in a slightly different regard. You can see I have a number of worlds. Um, this, and this, and this are sort of all connected. I've been using... I found a cool tool. I made a planetoids map, which is what we're going to play. I've been making my ma a map. I'm currently working on the third trial of a, a section of trials. <laughs> but I use this, and I have a world changer. Uh, well, essentially what this is is so I can get some... Uh, this is one of the... I think this is the fourth time I've done this to get some chunks. I use MC Edit, and I save chunks. And I've got some good stuff. So, we are going to play this one, though. We're not going to worry about the rest. And you don't have to worry about these. And that one's just there. It's not really anything. But, no, our interest is this. Minecraft with planetoids. And they're pretty large. I made some rather large planetoids. We've got a giant glowstone planetoid near us. Uh, and from the looks of things, I thought I saw a pig for a second. No, but I see a stone planetoid right under us. So our first first thing is wood. And I see a little tree planetoid there. Because if you don't get wood, you can't do much. And I do see... Oh, it looks like a steam pop up. That's okay. That's going to be our bigger issue, is finding lumber. Ugh, they're all small little tree planetoids. There's a big one down there, though. There's some biggies. So, we're going to play this vanilla. Um, and I've already earned one achievement, which is opening my inventory. And we're going to take a risk! Whew, we made it! We landed safe and sound on this glowstone planetoid. Now some of these planetoids are hollow within. I couldn't tell you which ones. That is a small spawn planetoid. Usually you spawn on really nice big ones. This would be a good chance to get some lighting. Ugh, I'm already suffering hunger. In this game, hunger is so serious now, I've found. Like I have to spend hours on hand just getting food prepped, but then that's Minecraft for me. Despite the changes, the game is still good to me. Alright, let's see. Okay, perfect. Full stack. That makes us 16 blocks, which gives us some lights. And I think there's some leaves below us, so if we can... Shift crouch. That is really deep. I, I need something different besides this, because I'm never going to be able to do anything that way. Now, planetoids maps, there used to be a couple of these back in, I think, beta, was it? Like a beta, there were some planetoids maps. And I love planetoids. I just love the way it feels. We have all this open space. Dangerous at nighttime. I'm actually going to keep that as dust for now. Our problem is we also spawned rather high in the world, I've just discovered, from the clouds. I actually have the clouds on... What do I have clothes on? I have them on fast right now, so they don't block views. There is a water down there. I don't think I could land on it, though. That's the nice thing about water planetoids, by the way. Uh, I've kind of had a crossroad in which... Oh, here we go. I think this is birch, no less. Actually, no, wait a sec. That might be oak. Oof, it's not going to be easy to get to, though. Oh, boy. I should have dug out some dirt. Whoa! So the way this uh, video stuff's gonna go is uh, we're gonna record all the way to the end of the day and then partially through the night, I think. Um, I'm gonna have to do some serious punching to get to that lumber. I think here's what we're gonna do. Because, I mean, I had it go quite a few chunks out, so, I mean, we can do some ex extensive searching. The stone chunks are what we really want to look at. Damn, I'm trying to get an even number and I'm not. There we go. Alright, so I got 34 glowstone blocks, which should be more than enough to get me where I need to be. Unfortunately, I'm sort of low on hunger. We might make this into a bridge, a proper bridge, later. 
look at what's down below this is a stone planetoid. That's perfect. This will be a good starting area right here. I need to get some, some sheep. Actually, if I can just fight some spiders, I'd be set. And ding, 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 and ding. That's gonna hurt. Well, Geronimo, we're gonna take his fall. Yep. I don't know why, but you always feel like the heart, your heart sort of lift, jump from that. Ooh, actually. Ooh, there's lots of flowers up here. There's orchids. See if I can get these down there. Let's see, we have a uh, Azure. Oh, you know what I didn't do? When I was doing all these planetoids, I should have done a clay planetoid, and now I think about it after the fact. But believe me when I say I'm not regenerating because I took a whole day to get the whole thing set. Some of these plant hoods, again, are hollow. Some of them have secrets. Some of them have ores, so there's that. Uh, looks like the biome is... Birch Forest. So, yeah. I don't know if that defines the, the planet hoods. Hmm. This would be interesting. get lower. I could definitely get lower on this. Though small, this planetoid has enough size on it. Actually, I should try to do this decently so that if I spawn back here, or if I ever come back up here, I could eventually connect with my bridges. somewhere. Carefully punch the way down. Looks like I can go down one more block. Ooh, there goes the dirt. trying to get a little lower. That would be the center, so... In a three-wide tunnel that I might do later, this might be pretty good. Alright. Well, this actually worked out really, really well. I wasn't expecting that kind of a connection. That's great. It'll be easy to connect up with that one, then. So we need to get down to this one. This is a drop. This is a drop. Um, I'm actually going to put some dirt down with the flowers. Okay. One, two, three, one, two. Azures. I don't know. I'm not going to bring flowers down with me if I can avoid it. I don't mind losing a little dirt. There's giant dirt planetoids. So. And as you can see, a lot of mobs. back from this. Deserts with cactus, among other things. Is that a floating water block or is that just a glitch? Looks like a floating water block. Some massive stone planetoids. Alright. Let's hope that we can survive this fall. Probably. I think I'll just close my eyes and drop. We're alive to tell the tale. And what do you know? As I always said, Birchwood. Um, how do I want to get in this planetoid? How about I do it this way? Our first tools. We finally found some lumber. Hooray. So hopefully the entire exterior, or at least the whole interior, is just logs, and then I can just gather lumber. 
I was never very fond of Birch as of late, but I might be able to put it to use. I mean, what other people hate Birch to no end, I actually do still enjoy it. It has its use. It's a brighter wood. Good in certain biomes. Alright. <laughs> Long overdue. Where's the sun? There's the sun. It's just beginning to set. We're gonna have to... I'd say go down about... Yeah, right about there. Okay. So we need to make some planks and some sticks. And I'm going to make a wooden pick, because I'm going to want to mine stone eventually, and a wooden axe. Which actually does a pretty good amount of damage if I learn how to use it. Let's punch, let's break some of this lumber. We're going to break up to this point, but then for that, when we get a stone axe, we'll make a proper staircase from spawn to here. How many blocks down do I want to go from what I was looking at? I think longer. I'm going to say 10 blocks. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And then this will be 7, 8, 8. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. The next one will be 8. And then nine and ten right here. So then we should be able to go over <coughs> and hit that stone planetoid. I think this will be fun. So it's nighttime now. I will end the video in a second. Dang, I keep losing my numbers. Man, how well I did in my map making. I always had my numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Clear little area here to put the crafting table. And we're gonna make a chest to put a bunch of wood in. Alright, so I'll put the crafting table down here. Or a workbench. Some people call them workbenches. Back in Alpha and Beta, we call them workbenches. And in the Minecraft full versions, I mean, I still sometimes do. I miss that modded Minecraft thing with the uh, colored workbenches. Let's see. Right, we'll go over from this point. Oh, well, apparently I'm going to have two workbenches. Oh, I probably should bring one with me. I just realized something, though. Wait a second. That's not a chest. Alright. Put the logs. Minus one. Oh, and this dirt. I like I like even numbers. And let's set it up for a larger chest. There. Alright, now let's start chopping this way and hopefully we find leaves pretty quick. From our position it shouldn't be too many blocks. I'm gonna say more less than ten. No less. One, two, three, four. Later on I'll skip certain things, but for now, it's early. You guys get to see footage that I would normally cut. Not much here. The music is on low, but there's been little music. Oh, they want my axe. Well, in that case, I'm going to make something else, too. I'm going to make an axe. And I'm going to make a shovel, just because I might want to shovel. Shovels actually have a really decent attack speed, so I mean, I can keep going whack, 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 whack. Compared to an axe, as you can see, which takes a little longer. And then the pick's even faster. Uh, we're just doing more, actually. Oh, the shovel actually does more damage than the pick now. I didn't even notice. Okay, maybe this was further than I thought. Ah, there it is. Ah, we definitely did that well. I'm gonna break 
these leaves and I'm going to make a lot of planks. Okay, this is dangerous to do at night time because we could easily be shot, but it's not like we can't get more wood. Alright, so essentially connecting to there. We'll have a staircase leading down into here, guys. Uh, I might do like a tower and then connect it with this so that I can get to that desert. Careful with sand planetoids because one wrong move and we'll have none. I will probably have to build a base, unfortunately. That way, none of the sand falls into the void. I see zombies down there wearing armor. That's a scary thing. That creeper has seen me. I see skeletons over there. <gasps> and I just got shot by one, so uh, I think we're going to call this episode one. I'm going to do two episodes, and I'm going to upload them quick as I can, you know. But uh, planetoids seem like a good way to get back to Minecraft. And eventually, eventually, I may bring friends into this. So for now, um, for now I'm going to call it an episode. Where's the moon? Eye in the sky. Yeah, it's midnight. Safe to call it an episode. So I will see.